Hello, everybody. Welcome to my channel. And today I'm going to be talking about the difference between the Microsoft Office 365 paid subscription uh, version versus the Microsoft 365 online web version, which is free. The paid subscription version for the personal uh, version costs about $7 a month and entitles you to access to all of the latest versions of uh, PowerPoint, Excel, and Word. And that happens automatically in the background. You don't have to install the software or do anything like that. So that's uh, kind of nice. Uh, the free version or the web online version uh, has a lot of useful features, but it doesn't have all of the features that the uh, 365 subscription version has. So let me just show you the differences and you can decide which one works best for you. Okay, so the first um, one that I'm going to demonstrate is the online web version. And to do that, you just open up your browser, open up a new tab, and on your URL, just type office.com. And you do have to have a Microsoft Office account. If you don't have one, um, you can create one pretty easily. It doesn't cost anything. But once you do um, and you're logged in, it'll take you to this page, which is the Microsoft 365 web. Um, version of Microsoft Office 365. And you can choose the different applications on the left uh, menu bar here. And there's also an ellipsis, so you can choose OneNote and Forms as well. Uh, but if, let's say, for instance, we're doing a Word document, we can click on Word and create a blank document. And this is what your menu options will look like. Now that's going to be um, a little different from the subscription or the paid subscription version, which is going to have more features and more options available to you. Now, to get to the paid version, of course, you have to purchase the subscription to 365 and then follow the instructions to install the applications on your desktop. Once you do that, when you click on the Start menu, you'll have icons for the different Office applications, or you can also Type the um, like Word in the search bar there, and it'll bring up the Word application. You can open it from there. And then uh, that'll look like this, which is different than the web version that we just looked at. And again, if we click on a blank document, this is the menu that we'll get. Now we'll compare that to the menu that's available in the online version. And you can see there are some pretty significant differences. For one thing, we have additional tabs here that we uh, have options that we can choose from, like the Draw tab um, and the um, Design tab that give you more options and help you to create more professional-looking documents. And so if you're using um, things like the SimNet simulation environment or SimNet projects, you need to use the desktop versions or the paid subscription versions of the Office Suite to be able to do those assignments easily. So that's this bottom one. And you get to that once again by clicking on the Start menu. Uh, if you've used it before, it'll appear in your applications, or you can also click on the search here and type in Word, and it'll bring it up there for you. So um, hopefully that helps you understand the differences if you're doing, uh, like I said, SimNet projects downloading a start file and making uh, modifications to it and then uploading it back up for grading, you're going to want to use this one that is the desktop version or the paid subscription version. So hopefully that helps. And if you like this video, please uh, subscribe to my channel. And thanks for watching.